Hold on. Oh my god, there's more. Bro, it's fucking cockroaches crawling around here. Oh my god, I'm disgusted, bro. My skin is crawling. And you know I'm gonna make a video for my TikTok. Hell nah, y'all got fucked up. Look how long it took. I got the recipe. I got the recipe book. Got the pants that you run next to me. If I'm the bottom, then hey. It's only cause you want to mess with me. I need only good energy in my circle. And you became a fucking stress. How you move from the top and make it. I'm currently looking for apartments right now. I'm calling different places and seeing. Um, different options. I want to look at three to four today. So I'm looking on the website, calling and inquiring about each spot. So yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Writing down, seeing what type of vibe each spot is given. Oh, this is fire. They got townhome floor plans out here. I want to show you, but it's like not given show y'all. I'm thinking about moving here. So, oh. Don't play with it, don't play with it, don't play with it. Okay, let's look at these floor plans <clears throat> and these prices. So, and I just had my meeting and it went amazing. Praise the Lord. He has done marvelous, he has done marvelous things. Praise the Lord. Okay, Ooh, this one I only see. One bedroom is available. Oh, let me see. Okay, these are a, li a little pricier. Okay, let me call and inquire. I gotta get the bathroom, y'all. So basically, um, I wanted to call and inquire about your property. I'm looking to move to Houston. I'm just visiting right now, and I figured why not look at a couple places while I'm here. So I was looking at your floor plans, and I kind of wanted to get a little bit more insight. When you've reached our central leasing office, we take the calls for the property when they're not available. Um, Sometimes they're, you know, on tour and or on the other lines of the calls transfer. Okay. Uh, was there something I can help you with? Will you be able to give me price breakdown? So basically, yeah. I wanted to inquire about. I have five that I want to get pricing about, and then I wanted to know if I could okay. schedule a tour today. So let's start off. Okay, let me get their information up really quick. And may I have your first and last name? And at this property, our lease terms go anywhere from four to 15 months. The longer the lease term, the better monthly rate you'll be getting. Was there any particular lease term you're interested in, or are you looking for the best rate? I'm looking for 12 month lease, the best rate. And I'm looking for okay. what I can get the most space out of for a bin for my book. So I see you guys have a lot of floor plans, and I'm a little overwhelmed. Uh, Cause I, I, I want to look at them all. Like I, even if I self guide tour, I want to look at them all to weigh out my options. I'm a very in-person kind of person, but the whole goal is to be getting a bang for my buck. So if it's going to be a one bedroom, I want to see the most spacious one, or if you could recommend me the most spacious floor, floor plan so I can narrow down my options. 
and then go from there. So I do see you have a a, a townhome. I'm really interested in that one. Can you give me some more insight mm -hmm. of the pricing after like and all that? Yes, and then um, I would know how many people over 18 would be on the lease? Just me. No pets okay, either. Any pets coming with you? No. Okay. All right. confused about the apartment situation I thought that this was a different location that I was looking at and I already could kind of tell just by walking in the building I didn't like it um, the, all the amenities are on the first floor but I'm just not feeling this building at all and I hate the finishes so unmodernized I'm gonna show you guys in a second but I'm looking at the pricing of this and now I understand why because this was the cheaper pricing Yes, this is a two bedroom, and I believe I am. Yes, two bedroom, and this one is priced at twenty one forty eight, and which is a good price. And that's why I was like, why are they so cheap? But I'm gonna give you guys the tour. So I don't like the smell. It smells like mold when you first walk in, and the lighting, as you can see, is very dim. So when you first walk in, it's brown flooring, glossy, just so dated. I just hate that for me. And then you go over here and you have the study area, which again, I don't like the lighting. It's very, very dark. You got a little cloak closet right here. And then when you go this way, you have a bathroom, which I'm guessing this is laundry right here, which this is not a bad floor plan, but like, like I said, like as you can see, like it's just dated, like very not modern. But we'll go into that bathroom in a second. This is locked. Another, I'm guessing this is the pantry right here. And then when you come in, it's very bright. As you can see, when I first started the video, the video it was mad bright. But again, I'm just not liking the finishes. Like, so dated. And I don't really like that. Um, it smells like mold for real. Okay, those lights are cute. Got this area. Which this living area is pretty spacious. You could fit a sectional right here, bar stools, and still have a little dining area right here, bar cart situation. And then here is, like, look at the finishes. Like, y'all, it's just not giving what it's supposed to give. Like, look at that. So, carpet in the bedrooms, traditional window situation. Um, not a high floor. The bathroom looks pretty spacious. But I'm just not into these finishes. Like, it's too warm. Like, too warm. The bathroom is just, it's just me. It's just a no for me. Like, be for real. Be for real, dog. Be fucking for real. Hell nah. Okay, this is another closet. Like I said, the floor plan has potential, but it's just not given what it's supposed to be gave. Like, huh? Like, be for real. And I didn't see a closet. What a closet? Oh, so this is the master. Pretty spacious closet. I'm looking for the light. 
Look, y'all, we not even gonna waste our time. Okay. I hate that ceiling fan. It's just not giving. This is a pretty spacious room, too. Like I said, oh, this is... Is that a fucking roach? Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Be for real, dog. Oh, hell nah. Hell nah. I don't even want to see the rest of this And you know I'm going to make a video for my TikTok. Hell nah. Y'all got I'm in on y'all heads. Okay. I was in here by myself until I went to the. Oh my God, there's more. Bro, it's fucking cockroaches crawling around here. Oh my God, I'm disgusted, bro. My skin is crawling. Get the. Nick, why? Why I go into the apartment that I just looked at and. You know, it, it wasn't given, and it makes sense because the prices for a two bedroom was like 21. And when I started seeing other buildings, but. Guys, so here I'm at the other building and it's so crazy because the way you walk in is like so different like I saw it online but I didn't know if I liked it because they had a two bedroom but they said it just got leased out but so right here is like a little I think electrical whatever it's locked and then you walk straight into the bedroom y'all but the stairs is right here to go downstairs so look at the cute lighting in here it's just so bright I'm not really a carpet girl because of my hair and um my allergies but this I, I i can make it work it has a little nook in here a little den area i'm trying to make sure i got good angles really good lighting in here i'm gonna flip the camera after i'm done showing y'all it has its own little balcony situation we'll go out there in a second and then the washer and dryer is in here too which i'm a little scared because it's i mean the, the thermostat is in here too but i'm like it's gonna get hot but that's good that my laundry is in my room. I mean, everything is gonna be up here. The closet is here, everything is here, so. And then they have shelving in there, which is really good. And then we have like another, like this area right here, I don't think it could just stay plain. Like, it probably can't fit much. Definitely could fit like a little seating area right here. Probably like a little chair right here, a little table, so I could, you know, drink my coffee in the morning. You could talk, Colette. Drink my coffee in the morning, have a nice little pockets of peace. It's, it's giving vanity. It's giving vanity sunlight, a little vanity nook right there. Okay. Like a floating, a floating vanity right there. Or over here. No, that, there's no lighting. See how dark this is? No, but you know me. I, I use artificial lighting. I'm not going to use sunlight. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, so. Either or. Either yeah. Or. One for makeup, one for hair, so your bathroom stay clear, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bathroom. Bath bathroom can stay for um, skincare only, you know? Yeah. And so, here is the bathroom, which is all white, which this is why I agree with my sister, because it's so intimidating keeping this stuff clean. So, definitely love this. I would change out the lighting because it is more so yellow, but really spacious for skincare and all that. They have a lot of drawers and space in here. And then you have the well, I love this cabinet right here. This cabinet, need need that. That's where all the hair dye, all the hair dye is. <laughs> now we keeping that in the kitchen near the stainless steel. Um, okay. <laughs> but yeah, so, but we will keep hair products in there because, yeah. And then so we have the shower with the little cubby, and then the closet is so far. It, I love a walk-in closet. Like I'm grateful for that. Like shelving too. Definitely, and I'm starting my wardrobe over when I come here, so it definitely is gonna be good because I'm gonna be able to grow. But let's get into it, let's get into the stairway. Hold on, y'all don't give me light. Oh, yeah, and I love this because the pictures oh my god, like one thing I loved about my townhome in LA, y'all, was my staircase. Like, girl, look at me. Hold on, be for real. Look at the lighting right here. Ooh, 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 stop. 
Wait, look, look. Yeah. Just the vibes. You know the vibes. And then all the lighting in here. It's echoing, but look at all of this, y'all. Oh my God, let me flip the camera. So you have a window right here. Ooh. Ooh, not me messing up stuff. Okay. You got a window right here. Could I add mom? You got a window right here. Lighting fixture. And then here is the kitchen. So nice. I love the flooring. Not too light, not too dark. Real nice. And I feel like with this, you I could have a very comfortable uh living room situation and I still can have dining over here and I could still let me show you. I could still have dining over there and I still could do a bar right here. Like it's just so much more space. Hey mom. Kitchen right here. Hold on. Let me just flip the camera so y'all can see me. OG, let's get in. So here is, they have a half bath right here. So cute. I'm so hungry. And then, yeah. I love a good farmhouse sink, y'all. So nice. A lot of storage. A lot of storage. And a lot of room. Come on now. The freezer got a little less room, but. Okay, you guys. I actually really, really like this one. I rate this one. What do you guys rate this one? Because let's rate all of them. I rate this one. Let me take note. Let me see, let me put the person next to it. I rate this one about, I think, what you rate in this, Colette? I rate this like on a scale of one to five, it's a solid, like, it's a solid three. Okay, so on a scale of one to five. Like, I, don't, I don't see you doing nothing below this type of layout. Okay, all right. So this is like the standard, you can do this or better. Like, for what, you, for what I know your aesthetic to be, this is the standard. It's only up from here. No. Okay. So she rates it a three. I rate it about a four. I rate it about a four because I do know the other ones I'm going to be looking at are two bedrooms, two baths, and they are going to be completely different. So I'm going to rate this one a four because of the stairs. Like, oh my God, yes. So anyway, let me move on. I got three more to look at, and then I got one more apartment. So I'll be back, y'all. So we just got to the second apartment. This is a two bedroom, two bath. What's crazy about this one is it's only $10 difference and I'm getting, a, it's only a $10 difference and I'm getting a whole nother bedroom. But the floor plan is just a little blah. Like I've never been into this whole cylinder in the crib. So here is the living room area right here. They give you a light fixture. The patio is pretty spacious. We'll get to that in a second. You have a little dining room area right here. Dining room table vibes or um, a bar, whatever you want to do. You got the laundry right here. Really big counter space, really big kitchen space. They did a really great job with executing that here. I love all of that space. Look at that. The only thing I'm not feeling about this, well, another thing I'm not feeling about this is how dark it feels in here. The other place felt really bright and welcoming. And this is just giving a little bit of like dark, as you can see, like, yeah. So here's one of the bedrooms right here. I think this is the second bedroom, not the master one. Again, it's just, it feels dark in here. And yeah, so here is the bathroom. 
pretty bright in the bathroom. Really nice finish on the cabinets and the drawers and stuff. Flooring is beautiful. And then you have the closet right here. Pretty spacious. And then another storage closet right here. And my camera's gonna die, so let me hurry up. Okay, so you come out of here, you make a left, and then you have your living room area once again, which kind of connects out to the courtyard kind of amenity. And then you have the master bathroom, which to me, I guess this isn't the map. It, it's bigger in the closet you're about to see, but it gives you access from outside, which makes me feel like that one's more private. It's these two little windows. But yeah, this one, I don't know. Feels a little bit bigger. Has a better shower you're gonna see in a second. And the closet. Mad spacious. Like this shit look mad good, yo. Like y'all see the storage in here? Like stop playing, son. Okay, so here is this bathroom. Like I said, I love the bathroom finishes. I love the finishes of the whole like apartment here. Don't like that towel in there. But yeah, same kind of vibe as that. One bedroom townhome vibe. I just hate this big old cinder block. And then it's not painted correctly. Like I've just never been into that concrete aesthetic. But what do you rate this one? On a scale of one to five. I didn't get to see the bedrooms. I did show you, you weren't paying attention. No, only, only the downstairs you show the kitchen. Mom, I showed you. Do it again. On a scale of one to five, I give this one a three. Yeah, I would say a three, two and a half, three. You gave the other one a three. Yeah, so I gave the other one a four. This is yeah. definitely a three because I don't like that big thing in the middle. It's so like, oh. It's a bowl. It's a bowl. It's a bowl. It's a bowl. So petty. You know, but this <laughs> My mom said, it's a bowl. She doesn't have to go buy one. <laughs> it's too thick and, um. <laughs> Okay, you guys, so we have now made it to the third apartment. This is a two bedroom, two bath as well. It is the same price as the first bedroom with the townhome vibe. So I got my mama and my sister on the phone. They're gonna critique it with me. Y'all don't have to be on camera. I'm not, not Colette left. <laughs> Y'all, my family, they do not wanna be on camera for nothing. Like at all. Okay, she left the con- Why she left? Like, I don't have all day. Okay, are you here? Okay, I wasn't- I wasn't putting your face on it. Mom, they can't see all that. Y'all, look at my mama putting on makeup. Mom, they can't see all that. No, it's not a for it. It's not focusing. Oh, look at my sister at the bottom. Where's my niece? Hey. Oh, she's knocked out. Okay. Okay. All right, you guys. So when you first walk in, let's wait for this to focus. This is what you see. I had to charge my vlog camera a little bit. So it's definitely way more bright in here. We don't have that annoying cinder block. So when you come to this side of the house, or the apartment, you see all these doors and it's a lot going on over here. So right here, you have a coat closet. Open it up. Right here, not the shades. <laughs> now y'all see where I get it from? Let me, let me hold on. <laughs> not the light. She need a YouTube channel. Yeah. Use the OG shop at me the cold shades. Anyways, so you come right here. Mom, 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 mom. Put, put them back on, mom. Say it, it's at the dick. What you to say? Say it's at the dick. Big dick. I love that for me. Okay, so look, we have the washer and the dryer right here. Love the, the shelving in there. Okay, then we go to here, which I think that's like a locked closet. Yeah, which it is. And then right here you have this little 
Nick thing. Built in? It's a built in. Yeah, honestly, I would honestly I would put a mirror in coffee here. Station. A mirror in here. Mommy, I don't like coffee as much as you. No. It's not getting a designated station. So here's the living room area. Okay, and then here's the kitchen area. It's not as much cabinets as the other spot or the other two places, but it's still enough. Look at that island, though. Yeah, that island. Honestly, the island is massive in all of the units. They did not cheat you an island, I'll tell you that. Is the floor the same? Yeah. Okay, so now you got your two bedrooms. So here's this one, floor to ceiling, windows in here. Yeah, I'm on the eighth floor. I don't know what this is, y'all. I don't know what that's about, but. Is it concrete? Is it concrete? Yeah. Knocking. Yeah, it's concrete. Yeah, okay. All right, so then you go in here. You have the bathroom. Again, this is a another closet. Whatever. That's me. You got the traditional tub. Very spacious yes. though in here. Like this is me spread out with my legs. Like it's very, very spacious. Um really nice closet. Nice size. Sorry if I'm smacking. I didn't even realize that I'm probably smacking. Okay, so then you go to the other side. The West Wing. <laughs> Again, living room. Floor to ceiling windows, balcony. So you're only gonna have the balcony access from the living room. Really nice. Let me go out there. Ow. Yep. Okay, so then you go in here. Yeah, second bedroom, same vibe, spacious bathroom, same closet. Like they're literally identical. So if you was doing like a roommate situation, the showers are the same and everything. I like that shower in that other crib though. Okay, so that's pretty much it. All right, you guys. So before I go to the next one, I almost forgot to rate this. I'm rating this one a solid. I give this one a four, a three point five four. Ooh, I see Chipotle right there in a Starbucks. Hold on. Let me find out. Okay. So I'm rating this one a solid at three and a half, four. It is pretty burnt. What you rate it, Clep? I give this a solid two because um, I don't like the top in the master, and this has less cabinet. All right, you guys, so this is the third and final apartment for this building. This is a two bedroom, two bath. This one is more, it's $200 more than all the other ones we saw, or about two something and some change. So as you can see, coat closet right here, and then you have a nook right here, and then, oh, this right here is the bathroom, which is kind of cool, I'll show you, I guess. So you can, it turns into a half bath, but that's like the full size where the tub is and everything. And then you have your AC unit and this is, oh my God, I gotta get a thumbnail over here. But this is the whole living area and you have the kitchen right here. You have the kitchen right here. And these windows are like designed for. And then you have this whole area right here as well. So I love that you can have bar stool seating and then I could make my own seating. Here is the kitchen. It is super duper bright in here. Like, for real. Like, you got some views right here. The same finish. I love the sleek, gray, dark, white aesthetic. You have your light fixtures. Oh my God, this is so pretty. There's the balcony. I'm just thinking about the content I'm giving y'all over here. Like, uh, let me flip the camera so y'all can see. Hold on, oh yeah, there, there it goes. I know my hair look a little crazy right now, y'all, but don't focus on that. So nice in here, so spacious. So let's go ahead in this bedroom right here. And this bedroom is nice, but it is a little bit smaller 
This one has the regular windows and then carpet on the floor, of course. And then this is where you kind of go into the bathroom. And it's a little crammed in here than what I was used to with the other bathrooms. But it's still practical and ideal for the situation. And this is what I was saying when you open this slide door. And then it turns into a half bath. Kind of cute. And then you go back out here again. And then it'll take you to... The master bedroom, which also has floor to ceiling windows and a balcony as well. Love that. And then the spacious bathroom, double sink for her and her. Me and my girlfriend. And then, yeah. You have the walk in closet, which is very spacious. And yeah, okay. Let me see if I can give me a quick thumbnail, because baby, this. Is giving what it's supposed to get. So while I do this, y'all want to rate it? Mom and Colette? Y'all can rate it in the comment section too. What did you give it three? No, I give it, uh, I give it a, a four. Four. You give it a four? Four and a half, four and a half. My second favorite, my second favorite. Four. Four? Okay. Mom is giving four it four, and sissy give it four and a half. Okay. So my, um, uh, what's the last one? I give it a five, that's my favorite. Four, this one. I give it a five, because that's you. Okay, okay. so. Wait, wait. Okay, you guys, so we are here at our next apartment. Well, my next apartment, or the next apartment. And this is a one bedroom, different building. Love the finishes here. But this is already giving me too small, especially for the price. But I do understand you are getting, you, you know, the finishes are different. Like, look at the black trim, like high ceilings, all wood flooring, which is, oh my God, so pretty. You know, it's just a different vibe and a different feel in here. Which is crazy because I love the black finishes and the black touches. But I did, I'm not a carpet, ooh, the shower. I'm not a carpet girl, but I loved the carpet. It kind of felt homey, you feel me? This is so nice though, the finishes in here. My camera's about to die. I'm trying to make sure I show y'all enough. The shower though, with the little bench to sit down and think about life and thank God. And then the closet. I really, really love. Okay, this is a two bedroom. Okay, so this is probably one of their smaller two bedrooms. The living area is just a little pequeño, pretty. Ooh, but this bedroom right here is way bigger. But the other one has the floor to ceiling windows. That's crazy, why they do me like that? Definitely bigger in here. Let's see, oh yeah, this is the master one. So her and her sink because it's only me, myself, and I, and only my girl. And here is the shower and the tub, black trim once again. We love a lot of storage. Okay, love the double doors for this too. So super cute. I love the black finishes. Okay. Let me call my sister and my mama. This one, I'm gonna rate this one on a scale of one to five because I can't have no dining area. A uh, four, no, a three point five. Three point five. Washer and dryer. A lot of cabinet space, as you can see. And it's really the black trim for me. The lighting in here is. It's not too bad. This is a first floor apartment. Okay, the light is kind of warm in here. A lot of lighting though, but I like to be a little bit more higher up. Let's see how big this balcony is because it looks like it wraps around here. Pretty wide. Side door. Oh, it's hot out here today. But yeah. Okay, vlog. So we are here in the second 
apartment this is a one bedroom and this vibe is just giving me the old la vibes when i had the white finishes but look at the marble with the black this is just it screams abby nick right here so again it's a one bedroom i love the gas stove and this one has a wine cooler i didn't show y'all in the other one because i forgot because i was charging my camera battery um but yes it has a wine cooler i love the black trim it got a little study right here okay love the pantry space all that cabinet space and this is a pretty decent sized living room like this i could get down with because i could still do a lot in here so they got the little basketball court hey boys <laughs> let me stop but the black trim is everything okay so you have the washer and dryer of course i'm guessing this is a closet yeah, storage. And then let's get into the bedroom. Okay, so bedroom again. All wood flooring, decent size. A lot of greenery to look at. Oh, I just love that bathroom. That black and white. All this white is intimidating. So you got the black marble counter with the tub and... Oh, look at this. In the bathroom. With the shower and tub combo. Oh, the flooring is darker in here in the bathroom. Can you see it, Claire? And then black marble on the countertops. Why do we YouTubers speak like that? Countertop on the island. We all talk like that. Like, I noticed that. We all <laughs> have that tone of voice when we speak. So today I'm going to be making a video on this. And we're going to go here and there. <laughs> ah, okay. Ooh, so pretty in here. So bright. And I love that for me. Higher ceilings, for sure. It's very much cool tone in here. For sure, for sure. So, that's this one, and this one is on the sixth floor. So the next one, we are going to... Y'all just read them in the comments, because y'all, I'm tired. <laughs> um, and I kind of... I like this building, because it has more updated and modern finishes to it. But the other building had more to offer, I feel like. And it felt a little bit more homier with the carpet, not gonna lie. So we are about to go to the 10th floor. The amenities are on. Okay, so we're going to the 9th floor and the 10th. The 9th floor and the 21st floor have the amenities and then the 10th floor is the apartment. So let's head over to the amenities on our way up to the 10th floor. You guys, we are in the last apartment. I didn't record the other one because it was the same, just on a higher floor, and the finishes in the bathroom were just a little bit different with the backsplash tile. So here is a one bedroom with the study office kind of area. Here it is right here. So, nice little study area. You see it, Colette? And then we have the half bath. Oh. So, I got a half bath in it. With the black finishes. So, it's a one bedroom with a half bath. One bedroom, one and a half bath. So, here is your laundry. I don't like that this one doesn't have storage, like, for laundry. And then you have the kitchen. Same vibe. Wine cooler again. The living room area, I am not mad at at all. Like, it is pretty spacious. Enough for a couch and a dining room area as well. And then this is the bedroom. Wow, wow, this is big. It's a big bedroom. That's a pretty big, oh shoot, and a big closet. And a pretty big closet, I know that's right. And then, same thing, okay, so this is dope because these, this is the finish that I just saw in the other place that I didn't record, so it wasn't, so it's 
good that I record it here because it's the same vibe. I really like this. Like, this is different right here. A lot of cabinet space. Like, your crib should look mad clean all the time with as much put away space as these people gave you. Like, they really did that. Look at this view. Oh my God, this sunset and the sunrise gotta look crazy over here. And the balcony I know is mad big because it slides down. Oh, so beautiful. Come on, runway. Come on, runway. This shit look like an Airbnb, not even gonna hold you like a hotel resort or something. But look at this view, like literally in the skies. So beautiful. Look, when y'all ask me if I miss LA, I miss the views. Like when you look out your balcony or your window or your car, or wherever you at, you see mountains, houses, hills, just so beautiful. Like that's one thing I will always miss, but I will Manifest me getting a crib there in the hills one day so I could go there when I feel like looking at them views. Purr. Okay. This is a really big bedroom. Like, I really need y'all to see this. Like, it looked like the living room size. Like, it's mad big. Okay. And the ceilings are a good height. And let's go into the closet. I don't think it has shelving, but yep, it do. They snuck a little shelf back here. <laughs> so I love that. Period. Okay. Okay, girl. Honestly, this is my favorite. Out, out of this building, I rate this one a four out of five. All right, you guys. So thank y'all so much for making it this far to the apartment hunt vlog. So I want y'all to comment down below what floor plan or what unit you like the most chat with me down in the comment section let me know let's have a little debate because baby i am not good at making decisions i take every decision as if it were a life or death situation because i know what i want and i don't want to settle for nothing i want it to be perfect and i don't care if i gotta keep looking until i find it so help me out and i love y'all so much stay tuned for the next video and i'll see y'all in the next one bye